He told me to stop being crazy. No, he didn't. Oh, how dare he? I know, right? Because like, am I crazy? Yes. Oh, undoubtedly, like bonkers batshit. Exactly. But he is completely disregarding how hard it is for me being this crazy. He is completely overlooking your experience as the crazy one. Not enough people talk about how exhausting it is being fucking nuts. Do you think I like leaving him 35 voicemails asking if he would hypothetically move with me to Salt Lake City just because I saw his female coworker liked his Instagram post? No, but sometimes a little crazy seeps through the cracks. Yeah, it's honestly so invalidating for him to discredit all the times you're not being crazy. Like 80% of my thoughts I should be in jail for. And yet I've only committed arson once. And I wasn't even convicted. You're honestly such a hero for only setting one preschool on fire. I know you had two in you. And like, yeah, I bought a gun because he wouldn't tell me the password to his work laptop. Maybe that was a bit much, but like hindsight is 2020. Okay, but to be fair, that shouldn't even be brought up. That was during your Saturn return. Ugh, man. I'm gonna text him that. No, wait, I'll text him later. Cause he's visiting his mom and I've already texted him three times. See, sometimes I show restraint. Where does his mom live? Oh, she's in prison, remember? I framed her for the arson. Right, right. That was so iconic.